Hey guys, I'm Kelsey at Kelsey Laredo Hair from Pulp Riot UK. Hi guys, I'm Dominic on Instagram, Dominic25 from Pulp Riot UK. So today we're gonna to be looking at our Pulp Riot semi-permanent colors and we're gonna be sharing our pro tips to help you get the best possible results. So let's take a look at our Pulp Riot semi-permanent shades. So there are 28 shades and three of those are neon electric shades. All of the products are enriched with quinoa, which is gonna help give fantastic shine and it's also gonna add moisture and strength to the hair. All of the products you make at Pulp Riot are 100% vegan. And one of our pro tips while using them is that all of the colors fade true to tone. So this means that your purples aren't gonna fade to blue and they're able to be removed 100% with Pulp Riot's blank canvas color remover. So let's take a look at Pulp Riot paint by numbers and how we would select our shades. As you open paint by numbers from the right hand side, you will see purples, pinks and blues. At Pulp Riot, we use paint by numbers to select our shades. With our clients looking at the colours applied to level 6 through to 10 to help the client understand what is achievable on their canvas. All shades are intermixable for a pastel result, use the clear. Now we know how to select our shades from paint by numbers, let's have a look at application. All the Pulp Riot semi permanent colours are 118 mils, so a little goes a long way. When mixing the colours, always start with the lightest colour first and slowly add the deeper shades into the bowl. When applying the colour, always keep the sections fine for full saturation. Apply in a side to side motion for the best possible results. The viscosity of the products allows for a dripless formula and easy bendability when creating a colour technique with multiple colours. You can see how easily the colours blend together without creating any lines. Let's recap over Put Riot semi-permanent pro tips. Pro tip one, when mixing, always use the lightest colour first, then simply add little amounts of the deeper colour to create your formula. The Put Riot texture means no isolation needed between the colours. Pro tip two, Always remove colour with cool, high pressured water. Pro tip number three. When you process the colour, you want to let them process from 5 to 40 minutes. At 40 minutes, the colour is going to become hard on the hair and that's going to allow for a nice, clear rinse when you remove the product. Pro tip number four. When removing to change shades, make sure you remove Pulp Riot semi-permanent colours with Pulp Riot's blank canvas colour remover. Here at Pulp Riot UK, we offer free one-to-one -one education sessions. This is a great opportunity for you to get to chat through FaceTime uh, with another artist who's working behind the chair, and you can ask them any questions that you might have about the products, application, or even pro tips. If you would like to book one of the free sessions, simply DM us at pulpriot.uk and request to book. We also offer two free one-hour classes on L'Oreal Access with a live demo and live Q&A with a Pulp Riot artist. Welcome to the studio is for product knowledge and creative studio is to learn formulas, trends and sectioning patterns. Those are our top four pro tips. Thank you. And good luck.